They broke up. Yeah, they broke up. Listen, you guys can stay with me for a little bit. You guys can stay with yeah. Uncle S Fan. We'll, you know, we'll watch Mr. Beast videos and then we'll run out of content and we'll load up Hassan's stream and then make a comment about him and then play Monopoly, okay? Don't worry, Uncle S fans is gonna be a little bit different here, but I'll do my best. Uh, I mean, I'll be honest with you guys, I I've known for a little bit, right, that this was uh, gonna happen. I've known, I've known for a little bit. Uh, which kind of makes it easier for me to make jokes, but a lot of how like some other people felt, like whenever they first heard is a lot kind of like how I felt. Um, also, I'm an asshole, but <laughs> I don't know why I'm genuinely sad. Well, I mean, let, let's be real, right? Like, I mean, we, we can make all the, you know, parasocial Andy memes and stuff all we want, but if you want to look at it this way, uh, it's kind of interesting to think about, like, that's probably like, if, if you watch Miz, if you watch Maya, I mean, that's a big part of both of their streams, like as they were growing. You know what I mean? It's, it's, it's a big part of it. Like you like that, you enjoy that. Someone on LSF post said, this is what you get for banning me two weeks ago. <laughs> I love those guys very, very much. They're, they're very, very close to me. And uh, this doesn't really like, it, it might change some things, obviously. I mean, between them. I mean, obviously it doesn't change, you know, anything between me and Miz. And it doesn't change anything between me and Maya. I mean, I still hate her guts, man. I mean, she is just the worst. Uh, <laughs> I'm just kidding. I do feel like I can't do that anymore. I feel like people like, no, no. <laughs> no, I, 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 I feel like I can't do that anymore. Yeah. They broke up. Yeah, they broke up. It was very no drama. It was very well like, yo, like let's work through this and and do it the right way. It, it is not any like there was no bloodshed. None of that. The meme was that you hate her because she stole Miskit, but now you won. I know. Chad, the meme is dead, Satch. <laughs> That's why I'm really sad. I'm going to be honest. The meme died. You know, now that the meme is dead, it's like, what can I say? What can I do? SN has no content. My only content was hating Maya. I have no content anymore, guys. It's all over. The tailgate tour, football Thursdays, leading the, the most amazing guild in history of Classic WoW. All jokes aside, the biggest thing that's going to change out of this we need is that we. Austin he Show will be streaming much Let's more often. Chat. Guys, Wee. Austin Show will be streaming much more often now. Uh, I think that's something that we can all be very sure of. At the end of the day, that's probably the biggest difference. <laughs> Nick is completely devastated. Uh, Nick decided to take a week off because so what happened was we had kind of talked and Nick found out uh, yesterday and immediately got a flight you know, to go back home. And he just had to stay home for, you know, with his with his parents for, for a week. You know, he had to go. See, he went to go see his mom and he's just really, really upset. So that's why Nick decided to also take a week off at the same time Ms. and Maya uh, took some time off. So, yeah, that's, that's <laughs> yeah, I'm being honest. I mean, he's probably more upset than, than Ms. and Maya both put together. I'm joking about Nick. He was just as upset as Ms. and Maya put together. It's going to be a little bit weird at first, but it'll be okay. Shit camp, uh, I would guess that they're not going to shit camp. Why do they break up? It's just, they, they just kind of, I mean, they talked about it, right? I mean, I, here, I, I guess some people didn't see it. Now it's just weird. I'll, I'll go ahead and read it. We want you guys to know that Maya and I have decided to break up. We both want to be very clear that there was no event, no cheating, no drama that led to this decision. We mutually decided this is what was best for both of us in our current lives. We both care about each other so much and are still friends. We're supporting each other through this and we ask that you all do the same for us. Uh, we're going to take a couple weeks off this, uh, of streaming to process and take care of ourselves. Thank you for supporting us these past few years. We can both say that they've been some of the best years of our lives and we're super grateful. See you in a few weeks, Ms. and Maya. You know, if Ms. Kip doesn't start treating her better, he's gonna lose her. Sorry, that's too far. <laughs> I couldn't help myself <laughs> too late not even too soon it's too late here's the thing sometimes you hit a point we won but at what cost at what cost everything sometimes you hit a point in life when you can care about someone and you can love someone very much and you you try things out and you do this and you do that but then you just get to the point where you realize that for both of us long term this is the best decision and it sucks it's shitty but you just kind of hit that point where 
Butcher's Bin subscribes with a tier one, man. Thank you, Butcher's Bin. That is awesome, dude. Thank you. Thank you so much for that tier one. You know, you just hit that point where you tier one sub to the channel. And, and hey, you know, it is what it is. I'm glad Savannah explained to us why it's not our fault while we stay overnight at his house playing N64 and eating ice cream. No ice cream unless we win the Super Bowl, actually. So, yeah. Yeah, I'm, I'm literally Omega Lol, I guess. This my, my entire feelings today is Omega Lol, I guess. Uh, milking breakup content. Are you joining FaZe next? Guys, hey, listen. I'm joining FaZe, you know. Uh, as of about 16 seconds ago, I left OTK, and I'm joining FaZe. It's official. Uh, it literally just happened right now uh, while on stream. So... <laughs> And I'm moving to YouTube. I also did that too. That was uh, 14 seconds ago. So, yeah, I mean, this is just what happens. You know, this is just kind of what happens. You know, they, they dated for a couple years or actually more. How long did they date? Thank you. It is fan TV needed to hear those words right now, honestly. Less than three. Yeah, I mean, it's just it, it's just life, right? That's just, just how it goes. Uh, you kind of hit a point where um, that is that is just what happens, right? You know, you, you, you go Ms. through it, you try it. be disappointed if you didn't farm it. <laughs> Actually, you probably would be. <laughs> Actually, probably would be. I'll be honest with you. Miz is probably disappointed I'm not farming it harder, to be real with you. I think that, uh, I, like I said, you, I, I think you kind of get to that point where, look, it's not like it's not like you, you, you didn't try, right? Like, they dated for two years. You know what I mean? That's different between, like, not even trying from the, from the beginning. But they went for it. They tried. And it just happened to not work out. You know, they hit a point where they're like, this is, this is not going to work out long term. And I mean, that's it. That's a. It's just a fact of life. Right. Like. Uh, my personal opinion is, is some people believe that like there's like. Oh, no, it's because of his PP, isn't it? But realistically, we all know he needed to open up his schedule for his new neighbor to sneak in his back door. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> uh, wait, what? No, not because of. No, I just said true, and then I read this. Like I, I, I read the first. Never mind. If Maya thinks this will get her out of having to pay rent, she's sorely mistaken. <laughs> I think a lot of people think that, like, hey, there's like one person who, who's like, there's like one person out there for them in life, and it's like a, like a predetermined, like, oh, it's destiny or this and that. And uh, I don't necessarily think that. Uh, I, I think that people shouldn't necessarily. I mean, that's, that's just what I think. I think you, you choose who you choose, right? What are you saying? I'm saying it's not something like people think like, oh, like soulmates or this and that. You find what you look for in a person and that's what you like. That's what that's what you think you like, maybe. And you go for it. And then whenever you choose that, you do whatever you can to make it work. But then whenever you realize, hey, as, as good as this might be or seem, uh, you know there's certain things that are just the puzzle pieces aren't going to fit together. You choose who you choose and it's a ton of work. I wouldn't want to choose Destiny either. Yeah, exactly, QT. Yeah. You know, hey, and best of luck to, to Melina. You know, just best of luck to her too. Um, but, no, I'm just kidding. But, well, I mean, best, not, you know what I mean. Anyway.